hey y'all welcome back to my channel this is glow here at glow vision guys 555 hi guys i know you guys miss me i know i've been busy i haven't posted in a week because here uh some schools went from in person to back to virtual because of the rise of the covid so you guys please wear your mask okay and protect your children okay so I want to come here to do a tap in to see what's been going on in the collective for the weekend, guys. I hope everyone is doing well. And hi to my new subscribers and hi to all my day ones, guys. I'm so glad you guys are sticking in there with me, okay? Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, I already lit a little of my... And I've been so excited because I have a new deck, um, the Master Tarot deck, Okay. From astrology answers okay so i have the master tarot tarot deck i'm so excited to use it for you guys okay so we're gonna jump right into it first let's pull some angel guides i already shuffled the deck guys so we're gonna go ahead and chop them up this is gonna only be a general reading guys this is not personal okay if you find yourself confused then this is not your message okay we have divine timing, first card, and it's okay, okay? Everything going to happen in divine timing. So you cannot rush. You got to let it work its way in divine timing, guys, okay? First card was divine timing. So you have to let the divine do its work. We have healing energy. So some of you guys might need to heal your energy. Some of you guys are probably, you know... Thinking, you know, uh, maybe going through something, heal your energy, okay? Your, your energy is healing, okay? You have to heal it so you can move forward, okay? Let's get one more. I hope you guys can see. All right. So one more universe. What messages? All right. And do the work. All right. So. We have do the work. It's the last card. So do the work. So if you have to back up and, um, you know, do some research for yourself, you can do that. Do the work. Right. That's what I do, guys. OK, so divine time and things will happen in divine time. And guys, so no worries. Everything is going to happen when it's supposed to. OK. Healing your energy, healing your energy is letting go anything that at this time they are swirling around you okay with this card the, the angels are eloping you in healing energy at this time okay filling your mind body and soul with soothing and peaceful light okay so whatever collective that i'm reading for the angels are sending you positive lights okay peaceful light they are urging you to receive this healing energy and allow your body time to return to its natural state of godness. Healing is actually an energy that goes beyond the body. Okay, guys? It's the return to a natural and a good state. All right. So you have to do the work and heal your energy. So right now, whoever I'm reading for, whoever drawn to this um, video... The angels are sending you healing energy at this moment. You should be able to feel it as the energy change. Okay, guys? All right. So, do the work. Do the work. Do the proper work that you have to do to keep yourself happy, you know, and not so much for, say, worried about <laughs> some of the things like when I be scrolling, I come across, I be like, whoa, what in the world is going on here? Because I know half of the messages do not be for me because I have none of that going on. <laughs> and I'm a Capricorn, so Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising. So I pay attention to everything around. You have to pay attention to your surroundings, guys. Okay, so do the work. All right, so let's pull some energy. I'm going to use the Master Tarot deck, and I'm going to clarify with this deck, okay? So, divine timing is at work, guys. So, 
let divine timing um do as you know it please because you can't you gotta let everything uh work at its time okay guys so we had the six of cups somebody from your past and the ten of wands came out okay i'm gonna go ahead and re chop them up again what messages for the collective uh universe what messages they need to know when it comes to love oh we had a king of wands okay so someone here in the king of wands they sitting here they they watching probably waiting on their time they divine they they spiritual they watching you and waiting for divine time to come so they can come in all right we have judgments all right so someone here is facing judgment it's calling for judgment okay let's get some more we had the ace of swords okay these are some pretty cards and they so smooth guys the ace of swords means someone want to come in here and speak their truth okay because as you heal in your energy here's your truth okay it comes to you all right let's see all right we have the four swords and the justice and it's going to be justice in this uh situation all right guys let's keep going what else in reverse those one flipped it twisted in my hand back again four swords wow okay so spirit wanted that to come out so the four swords somewhere here is healing their energy yeah they, they sit and they thinking they didn't hang them swords up they tired of you know telling lies they they went through judgment here they they going through judgment here they facing judgment so they they have to come in here and tell you the truth because we had ace of swords here and this uh four of uh swords yeah so they they healing they thinking this person is thinking it's like a kind of person that knows what they want to do but then again they still don't do it like stuck in their own ways we have the five of ones they fighting off something here yes. Oh, I flipped in my hand. And they working on something. They working on something. So, whatever they fighting off, they working on something else here. Which could be, you know, just healing energy. Because they working on it. They like, they want to heal themselves because they know in divine timing, that's when things going to happen. And it will happen in divine timing. Okay? Because whoever this person is, they, they didn't went through a learning experience. Not only that, they're trying to have the strength. So, if this person have lied to you, they want to come in and tell the truth. They didn't thought about it. They thinking about it too. But they trying to have the strength to do it. And they working on it. It's like they stuck in, we had the three of swords here. They stuck in a, a way of like I have to like fight this off. I have to get right. Yeah, do the work. Same thing as the angel oracle, angel guy oracle said. They have to do the work. So that's what they doing right now. They working on something, and they trying to have the strength to to come in here. Tell me more about this four swords. Oh wow. Okay. So this is someone from your past. We have the Six of Cups here. They want to come in and offer you an apology, offer you something, bring you something. But they're trying to gain the strength to do it. They, they don't have the strength to do it. So that's why it's like, do the work, do the work. Get, get in there and get it done. They want to come in here and tell you all the truth or the unanswers. Um, that um you have there you go your nine ones yeah they don't want they tired of sitting there looking mm -hmm. they tired of sitting there looking and and wishing and hoping that you know that they would have did better 
But yeah, okay. This person here, yeah. This person is trying to gain the strength. Yeah, the seven of wands, yeah. They trying to move in a new direction. So whatever is stopping them, they trying to fight that off. Mm -hmm. There's something trying to stop them and trying to keep them stuck. Okay, yeah, it's something here, and it is something from your past. Someone from your past is only energy, okay? All right, guys. And we had a moon card on the bottom of the deck. So, with the moon card, it can go different ways. It can be with the next moon cycle, or the secret's going to come out. And then we have the Ace of Swords. Ace of Wands, I'm sorry, guys. Ace of Wands, they want a new beginning. They, they don't want no um, no more the Ace of Swords already here. They don't want no more um, secrets. <clears throat> so this person here, yeah, they like, I got to come in here and tell my fam, because this is a divine connection here, because divine timing is at work in your love life here. All right, so let's clarify some of these cards. Tell me more, universe, about this person. Tell me more. Yeah, this person, two of pentacles. Yeah, this person then made a decision. Are they trying to make a decision? Or they was jiggling in a decision with this decision that they want to make. They were jiggling. Um, yeah, and they manifesting you and holding on to you. We had a four of pentacles and a musician. They are manifesting you. And they holding on tight too. Yep. Tell me more about this. Ace of Swords. What's the truth that they want to tell? The Five of Wands and the Eight of Pentacles. Five of Wands is here twice. Okay. The Five of Wands. So they're really like fighting going through something right now but they're holding on to you okay they holding on tight it's like they saying i'm not gonna let go no mm -mm. and with the eight of pentacles okay guys tell me more All right, we have the Knight of Pentacles. So, the Knight of Pentacles, everybody know this kind of slow movement. So, they want, they're going to come in, but it's going to be something slow, which is divine timing. Not saying divine timing is slow, but they're going to come in in the right time. But it's some slow movement here because they they fighting with this, with some conflict here, guys. And the Seven of Pentacles. Mm-hmm. They sitting there and looking like the things that they did. So this person is like what I did, like when they planted these seeds, they thought that they was doing the, let's just say it this way. They, th they thought the other side was greener. How you say it? the grass was greener on the other side? Chris Brown song. So they know now because they planted those seeds and it took them nowhere. Took them nowhere. Yeah, so now they want to come in, look at that, with the Page of Cups and offer you something. Apology, which has already came out, which is with the Six of Cups here, with the Page of Cups, okay? They want to offer you something. They like, they, you know, and then we have judgment here again twice, okay? So this person is facing judgment, okay? So, guys. Whatever's going to happen, and then it's a learning experience. This person has been through a learning experience at the bottom of the Angel Oracle deck, okay? So, this person <clears throat> is coming in divine timing, guys, okay? They're coming in in divine timing. They're sitting there thinking, um, thinking how, you know, all the things they did when they was jiggling. You could say jiggling or picking someone over you. But now they healing their energy and the angels is wrapped around them to help with the healing energy. 
So they manifesting you back in and trying to have the strength because they don't have the strength to come in and just do it. Okay. Because if they did, they would have been done it already. So they trying to gain the strength. They didn't rest and rejuvenate themselves. They land there and thinking and thinking. They want to come in with apology. But it is something. That's why they fighting with these five of ones. Because it's something that's keeping this person stuck. With this eight of swords. Yeah. They like stuck. It's something that's keeping this person here stuck. But it's someone from your past, the Six of Cups. But they gaining the strength. So it will take some more time, guys. Because the Knight of Pentacles showed up. Okay? All right, guys. This is your message. Just a general tap-in reading. Please hit that like button, guys. Subscribe to my channel, please. It would be greatly appreciated. I love you all. I hope you all be blessed. And I'm sending you guys peace, love, and light. Till next time.